Okay, in this video, I'm going to teach you how to use your calculator for the uh, number system questions. Okay, so first of all, you have to press uh, mode 3. You could change it um, to the number system first. So mode 3. So your calculator will show a uh, letter here. So either it will show D, H, or B. Okay, so do you remember that in the notes, okay, I asked you to uh, have the fill in the banks and I asked you to write down once. Okay, it is used for, to help you to remember, okay, the meaning of each vocab. Okay, of course you don't have to spell the words, okay, but at least you know that D, okay, D stands for the deanery. It means that it is sub zai. Okay, H is stand for hexadecimal, sub zai, and B is stand for binary. Okay, but get a girl say a chili di zila, case a cocho yong zai, so I get up, eat it zila, hey, my little get up, diago yang man zimo. Okay, so um, you can change the letter B, you can change it by pressing the buttons. Okay, if I change it to D, I can press this one. If I want to change it to H or B, I press this two. Okay, 咁啊有啲綠色字喺上高嘅. Okay, so now, okay, uh, I will show you how to do uh, the questions. Okay, so for example, okay, I give you thirty. Okay, and then I tell you that this one is in the binary system. And then now I want you to change it to the hexadecimal system or the binary. Then what should you do? Okay. 那當你如果是三十這個數字是十進制我現在要你轉回做十六進制那麼很簡單 B is a stand for binary. Okay, in reverse, do hai yat yana. How about yi gala ngo hai jung ko jun jo hexadecimal? Okay, gamo to da la. One E. Okay, A, B, C, D, E, F, E hai do la. So, how about I press one E? Yx E. Okay, now I want to change it to uh, binary. Okay, it shows the same result. How about binary? It gives you a uh, 30. 給回三十這個數字給你了所以二進制、十進制和十六進制其實都可以靠你部Kelter去幫你計到你的textbook裡面的數 DSE的題目就不會給你是可以按Kelter 按Kelter其實很多時候如果它出現在DSE 然後就是1 so this is the end